Hi, welcome to our channel. This is Francesca and Fun. This is Francesca and I'm going to unbox this thing. It's summer camp in a box. This was from my aunt Audrey and I want to thank her for it. Thank you. She gave it to me and I appreciate it. I bet it will be fun. I already have a little passport and so I know that this is going to be like it too. Now, let's start. Oh, this one comes later. Ah, the flap. I'm going to need to pull down the flap for you to see. That has like four days. Oh, correction, five. Just gonna share a little bit about it. In the comic, 
A boy named Sam and a girl named Sophia go to Antarctica to research. Then they encounter sound and they figure out that it's about a, wit a widow seal. They learn from a scientist and they learn more about it or about them. Little seals are carnivores, and they also hunt under the ice, but that's okay for them because they can stay for under ice for 45 minutes, which is actually long. They stay on ice to protect themselves from predators because their predators are in water, but if they stay on ice, the predators can't get them because they need to stay under water. One predator is supposed to be an orca. They're very good underwater. They're shaped like a submarine. They also have blubber to keep warmth in and cool out. They eat codfish, octopi, and squid. Hi, we're done with the weather locker. So now I'm going to show you. This is it. Guys, look at this. That's the tensile energy. Connect. Okay, I'm going to show you. So, this is its side. Hi, this is my last experiment today. So what I made was a DIY blubber glove. And if you don't know what a blubber is, is is a fat that is under the skin of some animals that have adapted to living in the Arctic or Antarctica. It protects them from cold and keeps warmed in. Now for the experiment. What I'm supposed to do is first I'm going to dip my hand in there. So now I'm going to dip. Yeah. So what it feels like it's cold. That's without the blubber. Now what I'm supposed to do is I'm supposed to take this and I'm supposed to dip my hand in. You can make it by using like butter or something. Now, you're supposed to do this. It's going to get a little watery if you already did the experiment. Now, if you were me, then you'd say that you didn't feel any cold with the blubber on. That's how it feels for, for animals who use blubber. Okay, so now I'm going to see if I don't feel cold for about a minute with this on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. I didn't really feel any cold, honestly. And so that means that the cover 
Lumber really protects them. Now Frankie's going to try. I think first dip your hand in there. And just see how. And should I do it? Should I do it longer than you? I think no. Just try and then take it out and then if you're cold, then tell me. If you need to take it out, then get it out. That's cool, right? Yes, but but it, but it, but a smile can work. A, a smile can actually work. <laughs> I just I did longer than the track. It's so cool. So so cool. Let's see how marble can do. Hold on. Let's see how marble. Hold on. A marble isn't alive. Now we're gonna try with this. With coal? No, I can do it longer than the marble. Nah. Wait, the marble is doing longer than me because it's still in the water. It's because it's not alive. Okay. No, we need me to take it out so that we can be even longer. Because it's too long. Before the experiment was successful. Well, well, I'm trying to do it again. Oh my god, this is a tiny guy. I'm going to show you what lived in the Arctic, Antarctica, and both. So, a tern and an orca lived both in the Arctic and in Antarctica. A skua, a penguin, and a widow seal lived in Antarctica. A polar bear, an Arctic fox, snowy owls, walrus, and carbon are some things that live in Arctic and yeah. Hi, and now I'm going to tell you a fun fact. A orca, otherwise known as a killer whale, who is not a whale at all. It is a dolphin. Also, it has no natural enemies.